Hello, my name's Jake from Firestorm Games. I'm here today with my colleague Alan. Hello. Hello. Yep. Alan doesn't like being on audio very much. We've roped him in because he is our store expert and fan for Gumpler and Gundam and things like that. And I'm not gonna not gonna lie, I know very little about it. So when customers ask me, I've just got more an- more questions than answers, uh, just like them. So we're gonna ask Alan some of the tough questions that I get asked on Shop Floor. So first of all, Alan, what's a Gundam? Uh, it's a plastic model kit that's either a character or vehicle from one of the anime um, or manga series okay, of Gundam. Yeah. Cool, cool. And, and we have a debate on robot versus mecha. These are mecha because they're piloted. Correct. Yep, cool. I learned that. Not a transformer. Doesn't transform. Not a robot. A mecha. Some transform, but they're still piloted. Okay. That sounds pretty cool, actually. That might be in now. Why are these kits cool? Why do I buy this? Not a Space Marine. What is it? There's a universe attached to it and all these other things, correct? Yeah, uh, really rich. Um, going back to uh, 70s, I believe. Wow, right, um, okay. If not a bit bit further back yeah yeah the appeal with them is you don't necessarily need glue or tools okay um some of the simpler kits which are the high grade hg you'll always see that usually yep. somewhere on the the box uh, you don't need glue you just can snap the parts off the sprue wow okay. um and push fit them together but we would always recommend clippers you can snap them off sprue but just yeah just get a cheapy set of clippers like five six quid that's army it. painter yeah. etc yeah you can do as much or as little with these kits as you want you okay. can um yeah take them apart properly uh clean them paint them yeah. convert them that, that's really cool okay um okay so where do i start so i've got two two main branches of question here so let's start with the the law so we don't sell the law we sell miniatures but if somebody's coming on these look amazing i've heard of gundam but i've never managed to get into it where should they start is there a good start point is it comics is it tv shows is it something on netflix is it on disney plus uh well you can uh crunchyroll funimation okay. netflix have got some okay uh there's quite a bit uh nicely it's a uh, gundam mobile suit origins Okay, Origins, cool. Yeah, I can remember that for where to start. I'm putting Gundam <laughs> Origins into a search bar, yeah? Uh, yeah, search that, watch that. That's, you know, going back to day dot, the very start of it. Sweet, yeah, okay. Um, and there, it'll just build a foundation. i got to be honest, it was uh, Ready Player One. First, I, I knew Gundams were a thing. I got that, or Gumpler, if that's the correct plural, that sort of thing. Uh, but that moment, the Mechagodzilla fight, and I expected it to be a Transformer, and then a Gundam turned up. Yeah, RX-78. Uh, it's pretty cool. Two, yeah. And you said that's the iconic one. Yes. Uh, and like it, it jumped like it's out of serenity like that film is reference player one we know that and just just get that into like american mainstream really shows if you're not familiar with gundam it's it's bigger than you think um yeah. it really is so right cool so we talked a bit about the law where to start where would you start with the kit so i've got a uh, less experienced modeler who wants to just they look cool what i don't want to spend 70 quid on a kit they can't even build so what would you recommend so bandai kits come with a grade system excellent uh high grade uh, so it'll be HG, yep. MG, and PG. HG is where you'd start. It stands for high grade. Okay. Then you've got master grade, course, um, which yep. is a larger scale yep. and a lot more intricate. Yep. And then pure grade, an even bigger PG. scale and um, yeah, a lot more detail, a lot more time consuming. Uh, so yeah, you would start with a high grade. Yep. So in that classic Japanese sort of way, high grade is actually the, not the lowest, but it, it's your entry point. A, about 50 parts oh, wow. uh, okay, give, so give, or, give or take the, the kit it, but they snap on up average. and they push fit together so yes. you can glue if you want to but there's lots of articulation and yeah um, I personally snip a lot of my I do um, I file them I clean them but I don't think I built one kit and glued any of them oh okay yeah, yeah. I've got one that I'm working on now um, where I'm painting but yeah. uh, I haven't glued any of it yet that sounds nice what's a 30 minute mission kit because we've sold Tons of them, absolutely nuts. Are, are they a Gundam, or is it just another amazing kit from Bandai who make fantastic Gundam? It's kits? just a wonderful plastic kit. Right. Um, it's made for like small children. It's really simple. Big children too. I've big sold children. some of these to some of our customers. They're big children too. Uh, I have some. I yeah, bought some with me children. today. <laughs> Sweet. Uh, but they offer um, a sort of a level of play. You can play with them once you've built them. Oh, so they're okay. quite like action figures that you can build yourself. Yep. They, you can pick up uh, upgrade boxes, which yes. are weapons or uh, wings, yeah, tank tracks, really and cool. then you can customize and play. Um, but yeah, they, they are an excellent starting point if you want to try something different. Brilliant. Availability. So we're just going to very briefly talk because people come in all the time. Oh, the Gundam that was here last week, we'll look back in. We just don't know. Uh, the availability in the UK is questionable at best. We grab as much as we can, as often as we can. But it is fill in a spreadsheet, get it back in an hour, otherwise it's all sold out. And we just, we grab what we can. So if you do see something you really want, 
just grab it find the way just just take it buy it because it might not be here in a week's time and it might be back for another month or two months or, or even longer so, yeah, um, and import cost of fortune yeah that's it so a lot of our customers have, have said to us they're really grateful because they can now pick it up for a, a sensible price in the uk uh, as opposed to paying an over-the-top price from america or, or japan and shipping and import so um yeah alan thank you very much you've been really helpful today we're um we're going to keep stocking Gundam. We, we try to get into all three of our branches as often as we can. If there's something you see on our website, which we haven't got, click the notify me button because at least then you'll get an email when it does come back into stock. Thank you very much, Alan. Yeah, you're welcome. And uh, we'll see you again. It's in stock now at firestormgames.co.uk. Links are in the description below.